hello hello dreamers and welcome back to the dream queen by perla as always guys thank you for your love and support thank you for liking sharing subscribing to the channel and if you haven't done so i encourage you to do so it helps with growing the channel getting the video out there for more people as well as keeping me accountable for personal readings all information can be found down below in the description so let's go ahead and get started cancer what do we have for cancer um <sighs> there's something that you have been bottling up and it's almost kind of like um whether it is you or someone that you're dealing with i feel that this is more like your energy can so where you're blowing up on somebody somebody it's like they uh, you suppressed a lot you've held back a lot from telling somebody off and it's all coming out um there, there is a there is a sense of like um, Whatever you're going to say is going to trigger this person into reevaluating um, how it is that they speak to you or how it is that they speak to others or how they treat others. But you, um, not intentionally, but unfortunately, during this blow up or whatever, this you're going to make this person feel very small. Um, there, there is a sense that you're trying to you're trying to find peace when it comes to a home situation or when it comes to work. You're trying to please... Um, you, you were let's put it this way trying to please many different people and now you're focusing more of trying to 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 please yourself and find that peace knowing that no matter what you're not or you're finally realizing that you're not responsible for someone else's happiness you're not responsible for someone else's joy you can bring joy to other people but it, at the end of the day it is not your responsibility everybody has to be accountable for themselves right um and and, and, and this is something that unfortunately a lot of people are like oh well, you know if, if you have to be nice or you have to be this or you have to be that but yeah but there's boundaries to everything right because if you're constantly nice to somebody that's constantly tearing you down or is con constantly trying to put you down, then, I mean, at what point do you wake up and be like, you know what, I'm not accepting this? Uh, at what point do you wake up and you're like, okay, th this isn't right. Like, why is it that I have to be the bigger person all the time? And telling somebody off or blowing off or whatever doesn't necessarily mean that you're stooping down to your level, to their level. Because there is a sense here of uh, needing to needing to know what words to use or how to deliver a message without having it to get to that point without having to to feel like you're stooping down to someone's level but there's also a need here to go ahead and set boundaries now the the the, the letter p is coming up and again the only word that i that keeps on coming to my mind is like problems 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 a lot of you have been avoiding having a certain conversation a lot of you have had an issue with standing up for yourself because you have been trying to avoid certain problems there's a lot of things that you keep um bottled inside and the thing is that when you allow that to come out um it's coming out in a way that you're not able to control it because then you're just reacting instead of responding so needing to learn how to speak your to speak your mind without letting yourself get to that point where you're reacting and you're going off on someone in a way that um belittles them let's just put it that way because then at that point you are um kind of coming down to their level there there is a sense here of uh, th there is a secret that is being kept. I feel that you're keeping something from either family members or from friends, um, needing to kind of, whether it is, you know, finances issues, whether it's health issues or whatever it is, is almost kind of like you don't want to be a burden to somebody and, um, uh, whether it is that your family senses is something wrong or whatever it is, um, just speak up um just speak up communicate right um because the, the 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 main thing here that is coming up is like you're not going to be a burden right you're not a burden to to the people that you think you're going to be a burden um to okay Ooh, that was a lot um <laughs> the way that it was coming up um there there is an energy here of like wanting uh, you're, you're wanting to get back to something and wanting to go home or wanting to travel um maybe some of you will be traveling within the next couple of weeks or something like that and and you're just you're just ready for the travel you're you're ready and excited for the trouble now this blow up of this conversation with this person whatever you've been bottling up um 
that's gonna make you even look more forward to your travels or your little vacation um because there's a sense is like you want to get away from this person but again it's either like you live with this person or this person is like always there if they're at work or whatever and you just kind of feel like you need a break from them to be honest with you so let's go ahead and let's pull out three tarot just to clarify see if there's anything else um we have the three of pentacles uh what else spirit we have the empress and then we have the high priestess so again needing to needing to tap into that energy of Needing to tap into this energy of um, self-awareness and needing to tap into this energy of, okay, how can I deliver a message or how can I express myself um, without having to hold things in for so long so that I don't blow up? Um, there is a sense here of wanting to learn how to communicate a little bit more effectively with those around you so that you don't not just you but also the other person so that things don't get to a point where where or when they get completely out of control so let's go ahead and let's pull out a and for some reason my ear i just went dead like i, I start i stopped hearing everything um maybe it is the person that you're dealing with it's like no matter what you say they're gonna take it however they want and at that point there's really nothing you can do um, or maybe there's somebody that really just doesn't give two shits and they they hear what you're saying But they're not listening to the words that are coming out of your mouth and at that point to be honest with your parents So then it's like what's the point? Why stay in that situation or why even deal with this individual? So let's go ahead So I just need one card. So now the Oracle card can be confirmation to the reading your advice or something that you're not seeing clearly that you need to be made aware of You and your loved ones are safe, new moon in Cancer. Um, again, this brings me back to this energy of the secret that you're keeping, whether it's a financial secret or a health secret or something like that. Just know that everything is going to clear up. Just know that everything is going to work in your favor. Needing to re it's almost like you need that reassurance, that reassurance, that reassurance that everything is going to be okay. Um, have faith that um, whatever it is has already been um, dealt with. <laughs> well, guys, that is all that I have for you for this week. Sending every single one of you love, strength, and blessing, guys. Take care. Love you all. Bye-bye.